happy Easter, happy Resurrection Sunday to everybody. This is the day that Jesus resurrected from the grave with all power in his hands. He took the keys back from hell and now we have a chance of eternal life. And I'm grateful to Jesus. Thank God for Jesus. Alright. Hey guys. Welcome back to my channel, Sarah Marguerite. And today we're doing a foundation review on the Avon Cashmere Complexion Foundation. This is in the shade Java. Now I'm guessing um, it's going to be darker than what it appears in the bottle. Fingers crossed. So it gives you a coverage from sheer to full. 24 hour wear. I don't know about that. Water resistant. Free of fragrance and parabens and it is vegan. I am going to apply this foundation and we are going to see one if I actually got the right shade because I can't like physically just <laughs> just like um test it out. So I kind of based it off of the um different sh shades that they had on their site. Um so hopefully this is my color. <laughs> we will see. And I am going to wear it throughout the day and then I I am going to come back at night before I wash it off. And I am going to see if it moves at all if I am like just like a grease ball or if I am not so let's just get right into it it looks like it is a doe foot applicator which is pretty interesting for foundation um normally you get this type of applicator with a concealer so we gonna see I don't know so I just applied this much on my hand and as you can see is definitely darker than what appears in the bottle as you can see it definitely is a little runny but that's fine so I just applied some on my brush and we're gonna see it does not have a fragrance like it does claim so if you have like um sensitive skin or something like that it is definitely going to be okay for you and it's applying really nice okay this is just one layer i don't do a whole bunch of layers of foundation but it seems to be applying like it seems to be covering pretty well for just one layer okay it definitely has nice coverage I'm not even gonna hold you and this is why you have to go into two things with an open mind because <laughs> I am impressed from what I'm seeing this cashmere foundation feels good and hopefully it looks good on camera because in actual life um it definitely looks good to me so boom here is the here is the foundation without being covered or set with the powder i'm actually here for it so now we are going to use a concealer now let's see how this foundation does when it is layered with different products that's very important to have things layered on top of it without it like breaking up or just mm -mm, not looking cute so i'm just going to apply this is tarte shape tape concealer in the shade deep and i'm just applying it like i normally would Boom, boom, boom. Okay. Nothing too fancy. We are going to let that kind of like dry down a, a bit. 
just a bit but we are just going to buff it out with our beauty blender that is dirty but it is mine so it's okay <laughs> so I'm just going to lightly tap this in lightly tap it in okay the concealer seems to be sitting on top of the cashmere complexion foundation pretty nicely I don't have any complaints about it so far actually which is pretty cool oh I didn't put this powder on before I put the foundation on that's normally what I do because it helps it lasts throughout the day so we are going to see what happens all right so I'm applying um, a bit of this tr translucent powder everywhere that I just concealed just to set that concealer in place and help it not to become a greasy mess so I'm just going to lightly contour my face. Oh, I didn't get the rest of this powder off. See? Gotta be careful. So I'm going to lightly contour my face with the Black Radiance True Complexion Contour Palette. This is like really, really good. And it is definitely affordable. Um, I'm just going to dip into the contour and the sculpt at the same time. So it's not too dark and heavy and I'm just going to lightly apply it everywhere that I normally put contour. I don't know. I'm actually start at, at the top this time and work my way down very lightly because we're not being extra. Okay. And that is a quick nose contour. Boom. You already know the holy grail. Am Reezy and Anastasia Beverly Hills. Just tap that joan in there like that. And do you see it? Boom. This pencil is Chestnut by MAC. It's the best lip liner for melanated queens. Okay. And if you think that there is a better one. We can definitely debate because this one is the best one. Making sure that it's blended. You want to blend out the pencil as well as the lipstick, okay? I am actually going to apply this NYX Butter Gloss in the shade Terra Masu. Alright, boom. But I'm going to be super fancy today and I'm going to put Buxom lip plumping gloss in the shade Melissa on my lips as well just to add a little bit of a punch you know right in the center right in the center okay I'm going to use my all nighter spray and spray my face real quick hold on Bathe in it, okay? Bathe in it. So this is what we have. I don't know if I'm like 100% like, ooh, snatched. But this is what we have. Now, I am going to just continue to do absolutely nothing. Probably eat or like cook um, something. And probably watch some like shows on Netflix and then I'm gonna come back before I wash it off later on tonight and I, I will let you know how the foundation lasted stay tuned for that stay tuned for that okay so I'm back so it is now nighttime it's like 10 30 something like that but I began at like like four maybe three o'clock um, so this is, this is what we have. It is not her fault why my face is shiny. <laughs> Honestly, I've tried everything. I think, like, every kind of technique that there is. 
and this right here always gets oily I don't know why but like the rest of my face looks really nice I would definitely say try this out and let me know what you think and if you decide that you want to actually purchase this product and a whole bunch of different products because they have a they have a lot of like different products. Definitely use my best friend's mom's <laughs> my best friend's mom's website, which I will leave somewhere on this screen as well as in the description box. Yourayvon.com slash Rosella Holmes. Definitely try to purchase at least one thing from her page support the fam i just want to say thank you so much happy easter happy happy resurrection sunday thank god for jesus don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and i will see you in my next video bye